music. I'm not talking until there's music. There's the music. Okay, so the question that I get asked all the time is, what is the story behind how you got your job on Much Music? But I don't have 97 seconds to tell you that because that's a really long story. But I can tell you the story behind the first job that I got, which led to my job on Much Music. So I was around 16 years old and the cars were playing at the Montreal Forum. I went to see the band and there was the program director of Shome FM, which is a big rock radio station in Montreal at the time. I walked up to the guy and I said, hi, Rob, my name name's Erica. Can I have a job at Shom? And he said, well, I can't really give you a job interview now because the band is playing, but if you want to come to my office next week, we can talk. I showed up a week later and he said, unfortunately, I can't give you a job because you're still in school, but you could be my music librarian. You can come in every day after school and you can organize all the albums. We actually didn't have CDs yet, you know. And basically, I was able to go there every single day, hang out, learn about the music business, hang out with the jocks, hang out with the bands, and learn how to be part of the scene. It was an amazing job. Thank you so much, Rob. And a lot of people would come up to me from my school and say, Erica, how did you get that job at Shom FM? And I would always say, I don't know, I, I just asked. So that's my story. I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> 